What's going on YouTube? It's the 7th of September. Number one on the subject of the video, XXX Nibiru Sunrise dot move. All the comments are fantastic and everything. I put it up there because I have not seen anything like this before. The author of the video claims that he thinks we're seeing uh, like a gravitational lensing effect of something behind the sun. Um, that's really all. That's really all we've got. But I thought it was an interesting technique and interesting everything else. If you've got video editing software and you want to tear it up and see if you can clarify it, I, I might have something on my computer, but I don't know how to use it. So if you can take that, uh, tear it to pieces, and debunk it as, as something, then, then do. And send me a message. Let me know. If you can't debunk, debunk it, send it along. Let me know. I have one other thing for you this evening, which will be uh, Patrick Gerald. I was trying to figure out the name of this. I heard Cliff High drop his name and... Uh, it's got his whole own theory on 2012. It, if anything, it's kind of similar to what they talk about in the movie 2012. And um, I hadn't heard it before, but it was uh, it's interesting to, to listen to. Uh, he really focuses in on uh, not Mayan prophecy, so to speak, but he's going on a, on a mathematical system that he thinks the Egyptians and the Mayans had that they may have carried forward from a uh, more advanced civilization based on the sunspot spot cycle and uh, a certain winding of the sun until it eventually has such a major event that it throws us into a pole reversal. And it claims all within one hour. But uh, the best part about the video, especially if you're familiar with Project Camelot, is this guy has got Kerry Cassidy and all the, what's his name? He's got them squirming. I mean, through the whole interview, they are squirming because they tried to debunk him about 10 times. Someone even sent me an email laughing about that today. They try to debunk him. They try to divert the conversation to aliens. Uh, they are absolutely fidgeting. And when they ask him, do you think the governments of the world know this? What about the underground bases? And he just simply says in his uh, Belgian accent, no, I don't think that they know. They don't know my theory. Uh, I fucked that all up. Sorry, but have a look. Mm -hmm. uh, the first 10 minutes is all you need to... Uh, to at least enjoy it a little bit. Whether you believe the theory or not is all up to you. Uh, it's Gerald Salentio. He says, think for yourself and have a great evening.